Touchstone Pictures presents the story of a mom, a dad, a dad, and another dad. We all live together. They're a modern family with one small problem. I'm getting married. Will you miss me? Mary, I love you. Now they'll stop at nothing. Stop! To keep the right woman. I love you. Oh. From marrying the wrong man. He's not the right father for Mary. Go to your room. That's it. Three men and a little lady. You look very beautiful. I look like a dwarf. You snore and your manners are atrocious. Oh, you think that then, for You're a snob. You're a slob. You're overweight. You're disgusting. You're together? Sort of. Do you mind? You're like an old married couple. Are you married to us? Not usually. Whatever do you mean? <laughs> well, uh... Normally. You're getting divorced. Yes, definitely. From Peter Weir, the director of Dead Poet Society, comes the story of two total strangers who entered into a marriage of convenience. I now pronounce you man and wife. Bronte! Is this true? Yes, but it's not the way you think. They thought they'd never have to see each other again. Until... I'm with the Investigation Department of the INS. The what? The Immigration Service. The government changed everything. Let him move into my apartment. I can't believe you're saying that. But if marrying a stranger doesn't shock you, then let him spend a couple of nights sleeping on the sofa. Well, that shouldn't shock you either. <laughs> you don't like me, do you? We don't have to like each other. We just have to be married. There's been a major clampdown on illegal aliens marrying for residency status. Let me do the talking. How did you two meet? We sort of crashed into each other. Get that story straight. Mom. Dad. What's going on? This is George. The handyman. You hereby swear that the evidence you're about to give me is the truth. I'm a composer of the whole truth. A refugee. And nothing but the truth. He's not a spy or something. I'm the husband. Ah! Oh, we're together. Okay. Touchstone Pictures presents France's most acclaimed actor, Gerard Depardieu, and America's newest film sensation, Andy McDowell, in the story of two very different people sharing one very unusual relationship. You just have to thrust your hands down. <laughs> Green Card, a Peter Weir film. I think we're looking at a body count of 50 to 100,000 people. Secret. I gave you one thing to do, just one thing, to secure that package for 12 hours. Stolen. Now, six hours later, the base is on fire. There's a morgue full of Marines. We can't find that goddamn package anywhere. The most awesome weapon ever made. And this is big, like, bigger than even you can imagine. Has gone missing. <laughs> We can report that a total of eight Marines were killed and six wounded in last night's raid. Were all the casualties the result of the bombing, or was there any exchange of gunfire? The CIA are looking for an enemy. Why don't you just say both of us a whole lot of trouble? Tell me what you and Cooper had going on. One man is hunting for the truth. Coop said everything was in this file, from Langley to Barzell. Whatever's going on here, I'm gonna find it, and I don't care what you do. I've got wires on it, got tails on it, but nobody here is trying to kill you. You don't know when to let things alone, do you? In an instant. Three o'clock. The bells in the church of the Holy Sepulchre will join us. Without a warning. If you break our little deal. What is someone very clever who is trying to provoke an international incident? The terror. I won't be responsible for what happens to you. Maybe even a war. Has begun. <laughs> Dolph Lundgren. Lou Gossett Jr. Cover up. From Hollywood Pictures and Amblin Entertainment, 
When Dr. Ross Jennings and his family decide to move to the country... Oh, Ross, smell that air. They thought they'd found the perfect little town. How are you finding life? <laughs> but instead... It's all rotten down there. I'll call the exterminator. They're getting more... Would anybody object if I tore this floor around? I would. False alarm, then leave on it. ...than anyone's bargained for. I think we've got a big problem here in Canada. Now, experts are moving in... Rock and roll! ...and neighbors are moving out. <laughs> There may be some spiders around here that are very dangerous. This is way out of my He believes he came across one of the offending spiders a couple hours ago. Actually, he's probably still in a bar on my shoe. It's a roller coaster ride you'll never forget. Arachnophobia, the most fun you'll have being scared. Hello. Whenever you rent or buy a video, you need to be sure that the film you choose is suitable for the audience at home. To help you, there are certificates given to films which tell you broadly what the film is like. This film has been classified 18, which means it's for adults only. It's an offence for your shop to supply an 18 video to anyone under that age, so don't ask them to break the law. An 18 film will certainly have an adult theme and might well contain strong scenes of sex or violence, which could be quite graphic. It may also contain some very explicit language, which will frequently mean sexual swear words. The video certificates are there to give you the chance to make an informed choice. They allow you to have peace of mind and be entertained. Thanks for listening. Enjoy the film.